This is Mr. Best from the MMA Manor. I'm here at Five Star Championship 14. I'm here with the new amateur flyweight champion, uh, Muhyiddin uh, Abu Bakr. Yeah. yeah. I think I, I think I nailed that. Bruv, you said that better than that. anyone else, man. I, I, yeah, I think I nailed that. Um, so obviously uh, this was a, 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 a short notice fight. Um, was there any any hesitation in taking this one? Nah, originally I was. It wasn't too short notice because I was meant to fight one of his teammates, Pablo mm. Beltran. Yeah. I probably had like eight week camp. I was ready. We done about four weeks, mm. and then four weeks out he pulled out. Yeah. But on the same day they said to me, "We've got Joe Young to step in." I was like, "Okay, interesting mm. fight." He's yeah. more well-rounded, he's a bigger threat really on the ground. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just took it. And it was like, I was fighting as well, so I fought on a Sunday. Yeah. Two days before Friday, I was in college and mm -hmm. I, I see a text on the lesson and I say, Raj called me and I, he, he messaged me and I was like, when, when promoters message me, it's no good news, man. Yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah, is he yeah. pulled out? He's like, yeah, he pulled out, but we got Joe Young. I said, okay, cool, yeah. we'll take that, no problem. And yeah, it was just that, man, and yeah, well, no problem. Okay, the fight itself, uh, what were you expecting from Joe? I expected him to exactly that low singles, doubles, mm. try to. I, I knew he was gonna try to grapple me. Yeah. Um, he's got. He's tall. Tall for 57. So yeah. I thought, you know, let me kick his legs. And I think I only kicked him about two, three times. I think they all had effect on him. Mm -hmm. And then, yeah, I, I wanted to keep it standing, but I knew if I was on my back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm dangerous off my back too. You know what I mean? And I said, and initially I was thinking like, whoever gets. I think we can both do well in the grappling, depending on who gets the good position. So yeah. if I get top position, I can do well. If he gets top position, he can do well. Mm -hmm. But God is not top position, so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so, um, how many more? Um, uh, for, uh, so first of all, is there anybody um, that you're looking for uh, next? Oh, yeah. Top yeah. ten, top ten, man. So, Give me anyone, uh, man. Uh, if, if, anyone. If, there's like these are the top. Mokev, John you know, James. Yeah, you know, these like is that. You know, like Jack Eglin as well. You know, he's not even like out of disrespect. Like, yeah. you know, I respect like I see good fighters, man. Yeah. You know, these guys they think they can take me down because I'm a striker or whatever. But he's a purple belt jiu-jitsu, black belt judo. Mm -hmm. He got that 60 second work. So, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? uh, so um, how many more fights are you looking to have before the year is out? Um, probably. Ideally. I won't fight till for a while now because mm. we've got Ramadan. So we're fasting. And then, so yeah, so after Ramadan's finished, I've got a few things, then I'll hopefully go on holiday, June, July, maybe, mm -hmm. so June, Ramadan finished, July, August, go on holiday or something. Mm -hmm. If I go back to Thailand, maybe I'll fight in Thailand, the, the Muay Thai fight. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. when I come back, so my next fight here will be September. I want to get, I want to try to get three more, if I can. Okay. Yeah, three quick ones, hopefully. The weight cut's not too bad for me, I can do it. Yeah. Three fights in four months, yeah, no problem, man. Well. If, especially, if, especially, <laughs> Especially if they finish in one minute, man. Yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> um, uh, have you got any shout-outs that you want to give us away, man? Yeah, I want to give a shout-out to all my training partners, my coaches, everyone at ESKF, Legion, 10th Planet. Um, yeah, my boy Nathan helped me out, like extra stuff on the ground and stuff. Mm. Um, my coach Ahmed, my coach Legion. Um, yeah, my sponsors, uh, Mesmerize Contact Lenses, Ultimate Mixed Martial Arts. They've got a show coming up in Coventry, 28th of April. They're gonna hopefully do some good shows. Um, PT Academy, um, S3 Fightwear, Anywood.com, Joan Easy, you know, all my sponsors looking after me, Alhamdulillah. Uh, my parents, my family, my friends, everyone that comes to support me, you know, like, we always come. And, you know, sometimes I feel bad because I take their hard earned money, like, yeah. they're, I, I took. 60 pounds, 60 seconds, man. It's yeah. like it's, 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 it's expensive, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but the thing, 60 pounds, 60 seconds. But what what can I do, bro? I don't get paid overtime. You know what I'm saying? I don't get paid overtime, so yeah, I'm trying to get in, get out. You know what I'm saying, man? I prayed, I prayed so hard. I wanted the first round finish so well. I wanted to dominate this fight. Yeah. I feel like on the feet, he was. I kicked his legs a couple times on the calf. It was mm. affecting him straight away. And then I got a bit too complacent. I could see he was coming forward. Shot on me. I was like, cool, relax, relax. I didn't feel under threat. Did the business, man. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Uh, finally, have you got any, um, any any social media accounts as well? Do you want to plug? Um, yeah, my I just use Facebook and Instagram. So my Instagram, m. Abu Bakr 98, and my Facebook, Muhyiddin Abu Bakr. Follow me, and yeah, any sponsors wanna jump on? Help a kid out, man. Hey, now's the time, so, man. Now's look after me, look after me, man. Now's the time, isn't it? Yeah. Right. Fantastic. Great job in there, man. Thank you very much. Thank you for your time, man. Appreciate it, man.